Hey guys, welcome back to Freeman Guerrilla Warfare, and uh, we got a new update, well, a test version, and uh, it's version, uh, I, I know it says .90, but I'm pretty sure it's .93. Uh, you can load your game, and I did load it, um, seems to work just fine, but we're going to start a new campaign, uh, going to go normal, we'll pro probably do a realistic playthrough uh, when the game launches, but... Um, Oh, this is new. Why did you come to this continent? I was a recruit in the army. Oh, this is awesome. This is like uh, kind of like Mountain Blade start. This is pretty cool. Wounded in a fierce battle. I was separated from the main force and wandered here. I was a retired army officer who came here with few troops in search of new opportunities. Uh, for various reasons, I became a bandit and led my brothers to rob the rich and help the poor. That's kind of cool. I'm a doctor here to save lives. I was an unsuccessful businessman. I gambled all my assets and came here to take another chance. My family was rich and powerful, but I was determined to make a career myself and explore the world. I'm determined to lead the people of this war-torn continent and put, to, uh, put an end to their long suffering. My hometown was destroyed by bandits. I came here with the refugees. I'm going to go with this one. I'm determined to lead the people of the war. All right, what experience have you had before? A middle school gym teacher. That's hilarious. Um, a security guard. Delivery man, a thief, a nurse, a vice president of the student union. Um, a shooting athlete. Is, is that supposed to be athlete? I don't know. Hmm. I'm going to go with the security guard. Uh, what are your hobbies? Hunting, weight training in a gym, climbing, hiking, and camping, socialize and make friends, read books to study, and range shooting. Hmm. We're going to go range shooting. What do you think is the most important factor uh, in winning a war? Excellent combat skills, perfect teamwork, reliable logistics, careful tactics, and strong economic support. I would say... Careful tactics. You spotted a group of enemies at the top of a mountain. They haven't noticed you yet. What will you do? Shoot directly and neutralize the opponent with superior firepower. Shoot actively from a far distance. Charge at the enemies and engage them in close quarter combat. Use guerrilla tactics, engage and run. Call for reinforcement and try to encircle the enemy. Lay ambush on the path of an, uh, the enemy. I would say lay ambush. All right. The war is spreading to your village. What will you do first? Buy some firearms with all your assets. Sell everything you own and stock up on food and medicine. Plunder nearby villages in chaos. Gather militias and set up a fight. Yeah, that one might be good. Uh, lead the villagers to escape. Train the villagers and prepare to defend. Try to persuade the enemy commander and stop the attack. Hmm now buy some firearms I think we just go with this every time but we'll keep it simple alright and have they added any they probably need to add a couple more flags here eventually we might change it up this time I think we're going to go with this one alright Let's see what we got here. Head shape. Go with that. Wow, there's a lot of options now. They've uh, really got this. We will go with that. I don't know. Hair color. Let's see what kind of colors they have. We'll go with the brown and I don't know. I guess it's going to be all covered up, right? Sure. All right. We'll go with that. Good deal. 
Okay, guys, here is the new map. So there's kind of, um, I, I really like what they did with it. It looks good. There's kind of biomes now. So um, it looks like maybe you fight in these different areas and yeah, you get maybe you get weather effects. I have no idea what they're going to add, but I would uh, assume this changes the map that you fight in. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then uh, this is kind of a, is this a swamp? And then you got kind of the desert area. And the forest area, yeah. It look, I mean, it looks good. Looks good. They've changed the map so many times, but I think they're really starting to uh, get the maps to the point where they're they're looking pretty good. So I like this though. I like that that snow area. So there's supposed to be some lore and uh, some yeah lore in this version of the game too, which should be pretty cool. I'm excited to see that. All right, so here's our party. We got a couple armed bodyguards, it looks like. And a couple of these guys here. Um, looks like this is pretty much the same, except there's uh, spots for magazines. Or maybe you can give them grenades and first aid kits or something. Hopefully they don't uh, run out of ammo. I did like that part where you don't have to manage that. But you can gift them some stuff here. Uh, looks pretty good. And remember, guys, this is the test version, so there might it might be a little buggy. Um, definitely report all the bugs in the Steam store if you guys uh, on the Steam forums, just so the devs can squash them and get the real the final version out. But uh, what are we gonna go with? I I like this better than the Freeman shirt. I think this is cool. And do we get a, we got a pretty cool gun. We got a Remington. Yeah, try that thing out. It's a shotgun. But um that could be pretty cool. Looks like I got a little bit of starting stuff. I got throwing, assault rifle, rifle, SMG pistol, and there's a new skill for armor. So that's kind of cool. Alright, let's go um my marksmanship is pretty decent to start out with, but I'm gonna go with a little leadership. I'm going to get that up to three. Do a little instructor. And reduces death rate of your soldiers, improves the effect of a med kit. Probably go a little uh, first aid and medical too. Um, yeah, I already got the nine millimeter bullets there. Looks like we have a SMG. So I can, oops. I could throw that in there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the graphics are really coming along. This looks really good. Um, and then let's see. Does this use what kind of what does this use? Forty five ACP. I don't have any bullets for this, but we'll carry it around with us anyway. Um, sure, we'll try the shotgun a little bit. I'm gonna put some points in the shotgun. We'll put 20 there. We'll go a little bit in assault rifle too. But this uh this looks good. Pretty good so far. And that's the same. Same. Looks like that's the same. And then your companion, you got a new companion um spot right there. So companions are back in this version. So I'm pretty excited to see that. Alright. So where are we? We're plopped over here. We got five troops. Uh, how much money? We have three grand. What do I want to do first? Let's see. There's Olga. Now, they did say you can get them in towns and stuff, too, so we might try to go grab a companion. Maybe at the bar? Oh, here we go. Anastasia. How may I help you? Can you tell me your story? Oh, look at this. This is cool. I was born in Dubno. My parents are both teachers. I'm very glad to be born in such a family. My parents are very honest and open-minded. I can do what I like uh, and take a part in what I like, like them. I became a glorious history teacher in high school. I love history, especially Cherna uh, Chernif's history. Um, it is melancholy and symphony, symphony 
played in by 17 nations. I think the profession of teachers is sacred and it determines our future. But, um, but now many government officials don't think so. They think that fighting in this world is the right way. Blah, blah, blah. We'll keep on going since go back to school. Okay. That's pretty cool. Can you join me? Recruit dialogues. They don't have everything in. Um, let's work together. Okay, Commander, I'm ready to go. All right. I want you to form your own army. That's pretty cool. Tell me about the history. Okay. So we can click on these guys. And... Oops, not gift. They each have a, their own story, so you get their relationship up. And can you join me? Oh, he wants 5,000. Nope, we're not going to do that. What about this guy? Can you tell me your story? Uh, can you join me? He wants 5,000 as well. So we got one companion. Let's see if there's any missions that... Um, Capture one looter and bring them. Yeah, we could probably do that. Okay. Very cool. I like the little... Uh... Oh, there's a gift shop now. Huh, famous painting. So you can give these uh, cigars and tasty dessert and all that to your uh, to your companions. And that's pretty cool. I like that. I like that. This adds another element to the game. All right. Now for the fun stuff. Let's see. Ooh, grenade launcher? The UMP9? Um, AKM. I always like the AKM. That's one of my favorite guns. We might go try to save up for that all right let's let's uh check some fighting out let's see if we can find some bandits but we did get one companion and this is what the new companion scream screen sorry screen looks like i can't talk today for some reason um economical so 50 percent increase in daily income will visit other cities will not uh actively attack aggressive while defending their own city they will also actively attack the cities of hostile forces defensive focusing on defending the city only so i can change all this kind of what they do it looks like that's pretty cool on how they act and then i can of course talk to her i don't want her to form her own army yet i do need to get <laughs> i do need to get her a gun so i might give her that for now okay And good deal. All right. Let's see if we can find someone. Yeah, the map looks really good. They did a good job. Mountain bandits. Oh, yeah. So there's different bandits depending on where you are, too. So this guy's trying to follow me. I need I want to get this group of eight. Now they're all following me. Alright. Fight these guys. I don't think I could take 31. I can definitely do eight though. I think I could definitely fight eight. Can I not can I not? All right, these guys definitely want to fight here. I'm excited to try out the shotgun. All right, we did a couple circles there. Let's uh see if maybe we can find another group. Pirate base. Pirates. Oh. Those are big groups. We might have to uh, see if I can find a little bit smaller of um 
enemy here. We might as well check out some stuff here. All right, this version, we're at war with the uh, Uman terrorists. But maybe, oh, here we go. I can join this battle and help the Pazna. I want to help them. Yeah, there we go. So this will work out pretty good. Oh, I should change the icons too. All right, let's go. Yeah, let's go over here. I like how you can see the, yeah, the, I like this map a little bit better because then you can see where the hills are. I think this is pretty cool. This uh, strategic map definitely come a long way. All right. Here's the shotgun. We're gonna have to get really close with this thing. Probably end up using the uh, the pistol. So I'm getting by far the best FPS I've ever gotten on this on the fighting. So and keep in mind that we have all these other troops on here. I'm getting over a hundred frames per second. And that's with OBS and everything maxed out. So they definitely optimized the heck out of this thing. Seems to run really good. Oh, these guys are killing the mountain bandits? Come on. Or, uh, they're killing our, guy, or our uh, guys that we're allied with here. Yeah, I don't... Look at the spread. I mean, you're gonna have to get so close. Oh, I got, I got someone. It does have a little bit of range. Okay, so the shotgun's not totally worthless. Where's my pistol? The three? There we go. Oh, I can see where the bullets are going. I definitely need a scope, and I definitely need to get my troops up here to draw a little fire here. Let's get them on this hill. Let's get these guys over here. Are these other guys just gonna... Now the guys helping us out are not that helpful. Oh, whoa. Someone sn snuck up right there. Could have definitely used the shotgun on those guys. Oh, only got two health. Oh, I have no med kits too. All right. This is gonna be tricky, guys. We're gonna grab the shotgun. All right, on bodyguard, there you go. Definitely has some range, but 
I just don't want to uh, die here. These bodyguards are pretty decent. Oh, as soon as I say that, of course, one uh, gets injured. Okay. You guys need to, like, do something. Here. Can I get these guys to come up? I can't really control these guys. These guys are pretty worthless. I thought they would do something a little bit more to help us out, but they took their sweet time. Now they're moving. I don't know where they're going. I might have to follow them. Oh man, our guys are getting dropped. We have one dude left. I'm at two health. Might be a little bit harder than I thought. We'll definitely have to go get some more guys. There's no difficulty setting except for the normal or realistic now. So it definitely feels pretty realistic. I feel like uh, a couple long range shots and you're dead, so. Um. Yeah, they have shotguns too, it sounds like. Do I have any grenades? Oh, got him, but... Okay, so the shotgun works in this game. Holy cow. Alright, let's uh, leave the battlefield. Man, that didn't go... That didn't go very well. Alright, so let's see if we can get into a town. We lost a little bit of money there. We'll definitely need to get a scope and a gun. We might have to do some trading or some kind some kind of uh extort steal hire. So I can I can choose to hire these guys without anything, but I don't have any weapons. I'm gonna have to hire a couple of these guys. I'll hire one for now. Oh yeah, and I, I have uh her that I can throw in there as well. So, yeah. All right. Let's uh rename these. Alpha Bravo Um I'm going to change that one. I'm going to put her in this this group here. And you can lead this, even though you don't really have anything. All right, and then we'll get you guys a little. Uh, you're that's a little expensive for us right now. Eight, I mean, eighteen's not bad, but hundred and something. Okay, good deal. Let's see what we can buy here. Marketplace. Is there something at a discount? We can buy canteens and sell them somewhere else for a little bit of a profit. I don't think we're going to do that, though. Let's go check in the uh, Mountain Bandit hideout. We might have to take that over, too. So far, this is pretty cool. I, I like the direction that they're going. I thought the town upgrade system was pretty pretty cool. Um, and, yeah, everything's looking, everything's looking pretty good. We definitely need to get some better troops, though. Is it the lighting that makes it purple, or is it like the maybe it's the sunset or something? Okay, well I'm gonna see if I can find a smaller group. Oh, three. We can. T we should be able to take three on. Yeah, I mean I would think. Two versus three. I don't know. I don't have any health, so I, I probably should have used the med kit. But I do have a med kit. She doesn't have a Oh, no, she does have a gun. We gave her a gun. I'm in a position. Let me see if I can... Uh, inventory false. 
There we go. If I put that there, hit X and there we go. We got some health. Okay. Now, where are these guys at? They're pretty close. So let's just go with our two troops. We're going to bust out the shotgun because the shotgun is awesome in this version. I mean, one of those guys I think I took out from, I don't know, pretty far away. Like more than a football field away. And then uh, that other guy was pretty close, and he was a one one shot, one kill. So the shotguns might be very viable and if we get some city combat like this they rework the sieges and we, we do a little bit more close combat the shotgun could be pretty dang good so now it's not something that you ignore yeah this the, the everything looks really good i'd say the graphics don't really need much tweaking i think they just need to add content i mean the game is beautiful All right, I'm going to stay behind a tree because like one or two shots and I'm down. So they're going to be over this direction. Yeah. Oh, there's one. Maybe I just got lucky before. I hit him. Alright, let's move up. Let me see if I can sneak around. Oh, there's one of our guys. All right, we might have to uh, <laughs> That's pretty satisfying. Yeah, the shotgun, man, is really good. It's fun. Oh, dang. Got to get behind this tree. Where is he? I don't see him. All right, let's draw his fire with this dude. Oh, I see him. I mean, that's pretty long range. There we go. Yeah, you can see the spread on it. All right, we won our first battle. That shotgun's pretty cool. Not going to lie. We can uh, get our proficiency. I'm just going to take all. I don't like that marching speed uh, decrease. I don't know. I think they got to rework that. All right, let's go sell. We, we definitely got a little money out of that. Um... Marketplace, armor. Yeah, 108. This is a good little chunk. I won't need the iron quite yet. Uh, the gasoline is for quests. Um, I won't need a lot of this stuff for right now. Cigarettes, tools. What else can we get rid of? I can get rid of a canteen, beer. Uh, we'll get rid of the wheat. Important file. Can I open that important file? I'll keep that important file and see what happens. But 
All right, that gives us 1,300. We'll make that a deal. And we got 4,500 now. And we're looking pretty good. There's no companions at the bar at this particular one. Hopefully they make it like some of the previous versions of Freeman. Um, I'm going to upgrade these guys. Your companions didn't die, and I like that. So I hope they make it so where they don't die. Maybe if you play it on realistic, your companions can die. But um, but yeah, uh, I think on normal, I think they should uh, kind of be like Mountain Blade where they don't die. But uh, yeah, she looks pretty good there. Got those crazy boots, skirt, and tank top on. But yeah, we'll have to kit her out and get her all... Um, yeah, she's got three leadership, city management's one. We'll build her up, see if we can make her pretty, pretty solid fighter. But uh, I think we're going to call that for the first episode. I'm going to keep on playing this test version. And uh, if you guys are watching on YouTube, definitely smash that subscribe button. Come watch live on Twitch. Uh, come hit that follow button. But um, yeah, this is pretty cool. Pretty cool so far. So we'll do some more Freeman hopefully tomorrow or Monday. And uh, we'll see you guys then. All right. Take care.